you know, I would. I mean, you can research so much online that um, it's a good starting place. But then you really need to go out and experience a number of different vehicles, you know. So I would suggest that someone, you know, they, they research online, they get an idea of what they're looking for in the range that fits them, both, uh, you know, the, the type of car, whether it's a four-door or an SUV, two-door, convertible, as well as the financial end, what fits their um, finances as well. And then you really just have to go out and drive the cars, because I can say that for the last couple of cars that I've bought, the car that I felt would be the front runner actually ended up not being the car that I bought. And it was because I wanted to try a number of different vehicles till I had the one that I got, which by the way, you know, I have been able to, you know, if my wife wasn't with me, then I would take the car and go drive and find her and take her around in it. And that was kind of nice too. Um, part of the sale, the um, purchase experience here too, at one point Gil and I, we rode down to downtown to look at a car that there was in a warehouse down there that they have um, their new cars in a warehouse and then he brought it out to my office all ready to go the paperwork all done I mean it was a very easy process you know so you didn't have to go spend hours at a dealership you know unless you just want to look at nice looking cars